Good morning. It is Saturday morning and you might notice uh, I'm talking a little bit differently because I have Invisalign. I finally was able to get it done and some of you might be wondering because my teeth are pretty straight but I had braces when I was a teenager and they honestly did a terrible job and I've been wanting to get them like refixed for so long and last year before I went to Canada I went to my dentist and sorted it all out but I ran out of time before going to Canada to be able to get it done so I went back and saw him in like June or July and organized it all to be done and then we went into lockdown and I couldn't get it done because dentists were closed up until this week so I finally was able to get them done and I hate them they are so painful and so uncomfortable and I'm getting so used to it but um, I'm sure it'll get better with time but um, yeah hopefully the next six months will be worth it and I'll have all these little like things corrected that I've been wanting to do for a long time anyway so that's why I am the way that I am uh, today I thought I would do a super speedy whole apartment Saturday morning clean cleaning motivation that kind of video because I really need to clean my apartment and I kind of just want to do it quickly I don't want to spend all day on it so I'm gonna try and speed through this and give you guys some cleaning motivation so let's get to it I'm going to start with the kitchen today I have my dishes from last night and this morning and then I just have all these ones to put away so let's start with doing all of this Kitchen is done. It's nice and clean. Actually, I'm gonna put this hand towel in the wash and get a fresh one out, but that's done, thankfully. I need to do my entryway, which has been driving me insane. I have lots of boxes because I did a really big spotlight order. Well, it wasn't a big spotlight order. They just packaged it with a lot of boxes, which is just annoying. So I need to deal with all the boxes, my shoes, and just this table on the entryway. It's just covered in stuff. I just, I need to clean it. It's driving me insane. if you didn't know that you can actually use a lighter or any type of fire I guess obviously be safe on most shipping labels and it will turn black with the oh my gosh come on I think I need to get a new lighter this one's gonna be almost empty wow it really doesn't want to light there we go um the label will turn black wherever the heat gets to which is really great so then you can hide all of your details I don't know what it's like in other countries but I assume it's pretty much the same everywhere and then your details are hidden. Oh my goodness. Seriously, Spotlight packaged that in the weirdest way. This big one was actually two boxes stuck together. I don't know why they did that. It was fragile because I had two things that were breakable in it. So they just like super packed it full of all these tiny boxes that were never even used. I wish I could return them to Spotlight actually because I'd be like, here, use these for something else. But um, yeah, I'll take those down to the recycling probably this afternoon. I think I can do it today on a weekend. Pretty sure you can every day of the week, take it down. Uh, but I need to vacuum this whole area. And then, oh my god, work on this. Thank you. 
Okay, my entryway looks so much better. It's so much less cluttered and I just need to take that cardboard down, which I'll do later this afternoon. But, oh my god, it's so much better. Oh, look, my plant has a new leaf. That's exciting. I probably should give him a water as well. And then next, I think I'm gonna do my desk space. I definitely think I can clean it up. I mean, it's not too messy. It just needs a bit of a dust and a clean. Desk is done. Moving on to the living room. I have a little bit of work to do in here. It's a bit messy. I'm gonna start with putting away all this clean washing. Washing is done. I need to put away my yoga mat. I swear it's out like at least 50% of the time. And then this is just a bit of a mess that I need to clean up. I've been working on my whale cross stitch and I'm actually making pretty good progress. And I have all of my threads just out here. So I probably should put those away and tidy it all up. So many dried rose petals everywhere because I have this collection of dried flowers and this frame. It's a little project I'm working on. It is just kind of living there for now. I don't really know what to do with it. And I have changed things up a little bit. In this corner, I've put um, my old ottoman and then I have a couple of plants and things on these stools that I got from Anna when she moved. So these are just over here by this window now and I really quite like this little setup. But yeah, I just gotta clean off this table, vacuum over here a little bit and get these petals gone, put my slippers away and then put my cushion in its rightful spot and then I think the living room is done. My living room is pretty much done now and I think I will go in and do my bedroom next. styled up this rack here and did my wardrobe organization in my last video so I'll have that listed in the description if you've not seen it but my room is slowly coming together okay so I'm pretty much done with my Saturday morning speed clean I do still need to do the bathroom but I was kind of doing a speed clean and trying to get through it as quickly as possible because I am going out to meet my friends so I will do the bathroom either tonight or tomorrow but I'm gonna wrap this video up here I hope you guys have enjoyed this Saturday morning clean with me cleaning motivation video and up the top you can check out my last video
video down the bottom. I will leave a link to another one of my videos and I will see you in the next one.